Gregory's still on my list, but I realize I got bigger fish to fry because I need to be focusing all of my hater energy on Barbara. Spoilers if you aren't up to date with Abbott Elementary. Abbott is 1000% hitting the sitcom sweet spot. The characters are developed enough that we're getting inside jokes. Because this was a Mother's Day episode, we explored all of the teachers' relationship with their mother. I'm not gonna lie, I was a little disappointed that we didn't get to see Taraji, even though we heard her. But the running joke that Kevin Hart may be Janine's father because he's short and he messed around with Taraji is hilarious. When I say mess around with Taraji, I mean their characters, not in like real life. I don't want to start rumors. I just love how this show is a love letter to Philly and just the way that they bring in all these celebrities who are from Philadelphia makes Philly feel like a character itself. I'm mad at Gregory for the way that he acted last week. Not just for Janine, but also his date. I was rooting this man on the entire episode. Barbara may have great attentions, but she was doing a little too much for me. To me, that's the story of her character. She always wants, I guess, the best for the people at Abbott but she feels like she knows what's best and it may just be her maternal role but she's always going to push her rhetoric on other people regardless of how they feel. And you know what Gregory obliged her for a second and when she went too far he respectfully set boundaries. Barbara reminded me of my mother and I'm sure a lot of you can relate with me on this where they take on these burdens and these huge events and refuse any help. I'm not gonna hold you I was waiting for Barbara to be like ain't nobody helping me in here even though she refused used it the entire time. The writers and the actors did such a great job of making all of these scenes feel very cringy but also hilarious and endearing in some way. As irritated as I was with Barbara and with Greg from the last episode, I found myself forgiving them by the end of it. Still watching them, particularly Barbara, because I feel like she'd be toxic towards Janine, but giving them more grace because I understand the perspective and at least where they're coming from. But overall, this episode did such a great job of developing all of the characters. Once again, Ava had a moment where she got to develop her staff, particularly Jacob. One of the funniest scenes of the episode, Jacob finds his voice and looks to his community to help him with his job, which I thought was beautiful. I don't know what was up with Tyler today, but Greg was doing it for me. I'm not gonna hold you. This was another great episode that kind of let me forget about Janine's decision and how it made me feel. Solid four out of five Frankie Flames.